Okay, welcome back to the Cyber Bowl, uh, a product review. So, what I have in front of you are all new product drinks that are out in the market right now, and we're going to review them um, and try them, obviously. So, let's go through them all. This is Canada Dry Ginger Ale Orange Aid, Sprite Ginger, uh, Crushed Watermelon. Minute Maid Blue Raspberry, Sunkissed Strawberry, Fanta Pina Colada, Canada Dry Bold, this little guy right here, Organic Trio Fruit and Birch Water Strawberry, and then I have back here, Snapple Watermelon, some energy drinks, Adrenaline Shot Smart Energy, this is the Fruit Punch flavor, two new monsters, Zero Sugar, Monster Energy Ultra Fiesta and Zero Sugar Monster Energy Ultra Rosa. So, I'm going to take them all off the table now. And we'll try these one by one and see what they taste like. Oh, we're going to start with Energy. Oh, snap! Oh snap, about to get, these are warm, they weren't all sitting in my damn refrigerator, so we need some ice. So, <coughs> Adrenaline Shot Smart Energy Fruit Punch, that's what it looks like, there's multiple flavors of this, this is the one I grabbed, this one probably seemed the best, so, um, zero everything, it has niacin, B6, Vitamin B12, just like most energy drinks. So let's. Oh, it's clear. Oh, snap. I actually thought it was going to be red, <laughs> but it's clear. Oh, my God. All right. I ain't too bad. It's okay. I mean, chilled tastes pretty good. Has a not so great aftertaste, but it's pretty good. Yeah, I don't like the aftertaste too much. Mmm, adrenaline shot, smart energy. I think it's called adrenaline shock. Oh, it is shock. That looks like a. Are you really sure? Are we yeah. sure? Yes, it's a C. Well, it could have been a deformed T. No. Adrenaline shock. My bad. All right, next up. They definitely have the fruit punch flavored. You have to chug that. Down. Oh, man. Damn. Sprite ginger. I don't know how this will taste. Sprite ginger actually kind of... I like Ooh. ginger ale a lot, so... Let me give you less. Thanks. So you're not chugging over here. I'm going to gain five pounds just from all the sugar and all these drinks. Smells while like... we're on quarantine. <laughs> Can't go to the gym. Smells like Sprite. I, I think I can take it so I smell the ginger. Okay. It's Sprite with ginger, obviously, but it tastes exactly like that. Sprite with a hint of ginger. I don't like it. Yeah, it's not great. Um, ginger ale is way better. So if you're going to have all the sugar and carbs, might as well drink ginger ale. But this flavor together, eh. I will take it's okay. Sprite. <laughs> yeah. It's okay. Alright. So there's that. What you got on your side? Um, Let's try one of those. Oh, well, this one's probably gonna be good. Fanta Pina Colada. Fanta Pina Colada. I love Pina Colada. <clears throat> Can't go to the beach right now. COVID nineteen quarantine. Fanta. Everything is good usually. Mmm. Smells it. Yeah. Mm. 
Mm. It's good. It tastes like pina colada. It's not super sweet. It's though. not super sweet. Still super good though, but it's not overbearing in sweetness. So like you're like, oh, it's sugar. No, it's actually. It's got 61 grams of sugar though. That's a lot. But it doesn't <laughs> taste like it. So. It's very it's, deceiving in taste. Yes. Maybe it's because of the caffeine <clears throat> free. I don't know if all fancies are caffeine free. Don't know. But that is... Oh, is that one caffeine free? Yes. Fanta Pina oh, Colada. Yeah. Let's try one of your big ones. Sure is. Sunkiss mm. Strawberry Lemonade. I love strawberry lemonade. Such a windy strawberry lemonade. Oh. Look at that. Are you pink? Let's try to make it cold now. <laughs> mm. I don't know if I'm getting like Pink a hint of like everything else that's been poured in here. I don't know. It's not overbearing in strawberry lemonade taste. Yeah, it's not. Like most, if you go to a restaurant it's more and get carbonation than anything. If you go to the restaurant and get strawberry lemonade, it's way more flavorful than that. Not saying it's not good, but it doesn't have that of oh, strawberry lemonade. Correct? Correct. Like Wendy's strawberry lemonade, where you get actual chunks of strawberry well, in your strawberry lemonade. All right, so the flavor. I'm seeing all around town watermelon, Snapple watermelon. So I'm seeing this everywhere. Red Bull watermelon. Um, I think we have other crushed watermelon. There's a bunch of watermelon for this summer. That's like the flavor. It's the COVID-19 flavor. Watermelon. That's what it is. So we're going to try Snapple watermelon. We're definitely going to have to use the bathroom after this because this is a lot to drink. All right. Smells like watermelon. Yeah, it definitely smells like watermelon. Kind of smells like Jolly Rancher watermelon. It doesn't taste that great. Right? It tastes like watermelon, but not. It lives up to its all natural. Is that what it is? Yup. It definitely tastes like all natural and not artificial. You can tell the difference between so, artificial and natural flavoring. That's what it is. Lemon and watermelon juices, that's why. That's why. Okay, so, yeah, watermelon <clears throat> lemonade is actual flavor. I'm sorry, it's not just watermelon. That's why it doesn't taste like this burst of flavor of watermelon. Watermelon lemonade. It's okay. It's not bad. I'd probably get it if I was in the food court. But dum ba dum ba didn't we have something else up there? What was up there? What do you mean? No? Am I tripping? No. Over here? No. Oh. Alright. We'll go with the rando. Ultra Rosa. Monster. Let's try it. They're coming out with a million energy drinks and now a million flavors. <laughs> so, we're going to try them as they come along. Smells Everything's good. like super light pink, if you haven't noticed. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Wow, that's really good. Yeah, that tastes pretty good. Fruity flavor. Very I fruity like flavor. It. Yeah, it smells very fruity. <sighs> yeah, that's good. I would drink that. And a zero. Zero sugar and yeah, zero sugar. Yeah. All right, can and dry ginger ale and orange aid. Mostly anything ginger ale puts out tastes good, um, but we're gonna try this. What? The cranberry, the blackberry, it all tastes good. So we are going to try the orange aid version. Put the sweat 
Hmm. That's why he's ginger ale. I don't think there's enough orange in it. Yeah, and on the bottle it says 1% orange juice. I don't get that. Why only 1%? I guess for a hint of flavor is what they're trying to get at. I mean, you do get the hint of orange, but it's not like an overbound. Yeah, so if you don't want, if you're sick of the original ginger ale, you need a hint of something else, the orange aid is the way to go. All right, what do you got on that side? Anything? Canada Dry Bold. Bold okay, ginger well, ale. since we're doing ginger ale, now this is probably the opposite. This is probably like damn 100 proof ginger right here. Caffeine free though, so I'm assuming this is gonna be super strong. It seems like it will be. I'm gonna set this over here by you. Okay. <coughs> I got the corona. <laughs> That combination is strong. I'm smelling it. Tastes just like ginger ale. This is stronger though. Barely. I can't really. I don't know. I can't really tell the difference. I think it has more of a ginger. Maybe a little bit. Into it than the ginger. original ginger ale. Which yeah. is probably why it's called bold ginger ale. <clears throat> I can't tell the difference really. I mean, I, I do taste a little bit more ginger. It's definitely a little bit stronger. But the aftertaste is where I actually taste more of the ginger. It's not horrible either. Alright, what's next? So, a co-worker got me this. Todd did. Organic Trio Fruit and Birch Water Strawberry. It's like sitting on my tongue. That's weird. 10 calories per serving, 1 gram of sugar per serving. Let's see how much is in here. This is shake well. Um, there's two servings per container, so 2 grams of sugar. And an organic ethyrotol, I don't know what that is, and 30% <laughs> vitamin C. It's organic, so it says shake well, because it naturally sits. Oops. Alright. For organic, that tastes pretty good. Yeah, that's not bad. Tapping response. Usually, organic. Mmm. It's actually it's pretty like, good. Like, earthy. I don't know. I don't know what that means. Like, it just tastes less artificial than like everything else, so the flavoring isn't what you're used to. So most people, unless you've been eating or drinking organic stuff for a long time, just got kind of used to it. Taste. Fun facts on the bottle. Tapping responsibly prolongs the life of our trees, so drinking a trio is also good for our forests. It's vegan, gluten-free, good source of vitamin C. USDA organic approved non-GMO verified project. But if you like flavored water, like if you rather have flavored water than plain water, so that you're not even drinking all those like artificial. Powered by birch tree water. So, yeah, it's good. One net carb per serving. It was only 10 calories. That's not bad. I recommend. All right. Minute Maid Blue Raspberry. I love blue raspberry. Which one do you like better, strawberry lemonade or blue raspberry? Ooh. Uh, drink wise, I like strawberry lemonade, but like, if there, I'm pretty sure there is, but if I found a pack of blue raspberry dry ranchers, I'd buy them. Just blue raspberry. So I like blue raspberry? I love blue raspberry. Tastes just like blue raspberry. You want Minute Maid blue raspberry? That's exactly what you're getting. Yeah. It's Minute Maid blue raspberry. Pretty good. 
Pretty good, pretty good. It is pretty good, pretty good. Alright. <clears throat> last. What, how many you got? None? None. Alright. Second to last. Monster Zero Sugar Energy Ultra Fiesta. New flavor. Let's try it out. This kind of reminds me of Baja Blast from Taco Bell's Mountain Dew. Wow, it's kind of green. Good thing this is almost over because your ice is done. Alright. Smells like Taco Bell's mango brisk tea. It's very good. Tangy too. That is really good. And it doesn't taste like Baja Blast. It does no. have like mango taste to it though. Definitely mango base. Check it out. It is good though. I'm gonna be yep. tight. Zero sugar ultra fiesta blends juicy mango flavor into the ultra we love. Finish off with a full load of our monster energy blend. Yep. Mango. mango. So Ultra Fiesto, it's Ultra Mango. It's pretty good though. And last, dun dun dun, crushed watermelon. It's brand new, caffeine free, probably lots of sugar, lots of carbs. Yep. I feel like I can smell the watermelon already. Good little healthy. Oh, I can smell the watermelon. Mm -hmm. Yep. I can smell it. Alright. It smells just like the watermelon Jolly Rancher. It does. Exactly like it, it's actually. like they liquefied it and just put it in soda form. And it tastes like it. It even has a good aftertaste. Mm-hmm. Yep. That is probably the best drink out of all of them. Crushed watermelon takes the cake with flavor. Not for me. For me. It's not overbearing with flavor. It doesn't taste crazy sweet, but it is sweet. And it tastes just like watermelon. I'm not big on watermelon. I, I love watermelon. Like the best. And I don't really like mango like that either. I it just tastes really good. Well, there you have it. All the new drinks out in the market. Um, they all taste pretty good. I'm actually getting, I feel a little indigestion from the bold. So if you get indigestion, I don't know if this is for you. Um, but yeah, they all taste pretty good. Um, some not so much as others. But there you have it. Uh, please comment and follow. Subscribe. Uh, we'll be doing this for more drinks and some foods. I'm going to try to find some other foods that are coming out that's new in the future. So look forward to that. And have a wonderful day. Anything you like to say? No? Bye. Bye. Peace.